Hi, Aiden here. Today we're going to go over the Ruger Air Magnum. And kind of the same pattern that I do before. It starts out on top with a 4x32 on the scope, Allen wrenches for mounting scope rings. And then on the side here, you can use the giant screwdriver to, to tighten this down. You can hand tight. I don't recommend hand tight it. You, you definitely want to put a couple extra turns in there um, to make sure that the scope is secure. One of the things I really like about this is the fact that it has a Picatinny rail on top. So you can choose your scope. You can put whatever you want on there. If you want to put a red dot, if it can handle it, um, you can put a red, red dot on top of that. One of the things I noticed initially when I first got, got this gun was as soon as I went to cock it, I can feel it. So you're going to get a workout while you're shooting it, but that's also what makes it shoot 1,200 feet per second if you're using an alloy pellet. Um, today I'm actually going to shoot a 18 grain and we'll fire it through the gun here and just see kind of what we're getting for feet per second. And 795 feet per second which is about 25 foot-pounds uh, if you're thinking for energy. So this thing right here, this is your rabbit killer. If you're going to go out there, take rabbits, this is the way to go. Um, safety, again, is on the back. They're, they're kind of in the same position on all the new guns. As soon as you cock it, safety comes back in the, the safe position, and then you have to take it off the safety right before you fire it. Trigger pull is actually very, very smooth. There's a little bit of distance in there when you're pulling it back, but it's, it's pretty crisp and clean when you fire the weapon itself. It does have fiber optic sight, so if you choose to take the scope off, and you just want to fire this thing um, without the scope on it, you have open sights. There's a lot of people like to shoot open sights. It gives you the old school uh, air gun feel to it. But other than that, there's some other things that I really enjoy. The fact that checkering on here is phenomenal. On the, uh, on the stock, it has a good grasp. It helps you keep good contact with the gun. Um, and it's full length, so it's not just partial. They got a full length area here with good checkering on the foregrip, and then back here in the handle section. So, uh, other than that, the stock is well designed, good rubber butt pad on the end of it. I like it. And it's a Ruger, of course, you know I love Rugers. Other than that, I hope this guy's help you guys out. Uh, you can check me out at Texas Hog Dude on Instagram. You guys have fun slinging lead.